We are so excited that this park looks so beautiful. I wish we had all of these amenities when we were children. <laughs> but we uh, appreciate all of you being here. And of course, all of our elected officials. Thank you, City Commissioner Eliasar Guajardo for being here. Of course, our mayor, Dr. Ambrosio Hernandez. We have school board members, Carlos Villegas. Jorge Palacios. Jesse Zambrano. And of course, our new superintendent, Dr. Jorge Arredondo. So I would like to go ahead and welcome our mayor, Dr. Ambrosio Hernandez, for some special remarks. Well, thank you for coming out today. Uh, it's good to see the very, very, very young faces. Um, this park was built specifically for you guys and your, and your families. And uh, I'm sure uh, when PHH comes up, they'll explain to you why. Um, as, you, as you all know, uh, the city of FAR has always been looking forward to make sure people stay healthy. But it's one thing to say it and something else to do it, quite frankly. And so the city of FAR, uh, your parents who live here and they pay taxes, they want to be sure you guys have somewhere to play, somewhere to be safe, and somewhere where you can get educated. And so we partnered together, just like you guys work together in school projects. We did the same thing here because we know you're the most important assets or the most important thing for us as a city and also, I'm sure, as a school district. This is a very unique park. As you saw, the zip lines were put in for a reason. Not everybody has access to zip lines. It's got safety measures for the parents to know. We have a camera, we have audio visual, we can see it 24 hours a day. We're gonna be monitoring to be sure people are safe. That's what the school district requires and that's what we want as well as a city. We wanna be sure that you guys, no matter what you're doing, whether you come out with grandma or, or grandpa or mom and dad, get them out to where you guys run around, let them walk around, we can watch what's happening. And so safety is of paramount. It's unique in the fact that you've got water. You guys can play in water. Not every city has that. You have one in the middle of the city, and we were likely going to put one in the south part of the city. That way everybody has access to the same type of assets, the same infrastructure. But for us as a city, you know, with uh, Commissioner Guajardo being here as well, and our Alex Mead and our assistant city managers, I just want you guys to take away here as children that you know that if you have anybody behind you, it's going to be the city of FAR. And I'm sure PHA is going to speak on their behalf, but I know for a fact, it's not even a doubt in my mind, whenever we do something in the city of FAR, we always reach out for people who are experts, people who are visionaries and pushing the envelope. And that's why we partnered with PHA. Exactly why. Because you have great school board members. They're always looking out for you. And we know when we see a winning team, we go after it. And that's why we partner with you guys. And it's always fair, what we call fair and equitable. It's got to be the same for both sides. Nobody gets the upper hand in somebody else. Everybody wins. And this park is, again, one of the best demonstrations of what a city and a school district can do together for your betterment. So I want to welcome everybody to this wonderful park. It is a city, PSJ Park, absolutely park, PSJ, PSJ Park, far, it doesn't matter. We're all one community, and we're very happy to partner with you guys again on this endeavor because we've done a lot, quite a bit. And with that, uh, I'd like to ask uh, President Palacios to come up with a few words. What excitement. I, I, I walked up and I saw this park and I was just in awe because I don't think they had parks like this when I was growing up. Uh, most of our parks were like a field with caliche and, and, and stickers and things like this. But this is really, really awesome. You have lighting. You have a really nice track to walk on. And, and I, I even saw a phone in case there's an emergency. You can actually call and get help. I, I really like that. Uh, it does my heart good to know that we can partner with the city of FAR and make a park like this for you all. And I say you all, I mean you students, but I also mean the community. You have a place to come where you can be safe, you can work out. Uh, you know, it's all about, and the world right now is really dealing with, with health, wellness, and, and being able to just move. And so we, we were really glad to partner with the city to be able to make this park a park that you can use uh, you can come and play in, and you can have a safe environment uh, where you know you can come, your parents can come, and, and spend good quality time together and, and make it a, a healthy uh, environment for all of us. And I say all of us because I'm from the city of FAR. I live here, and when I see this type of a park, it really, like I said, it really makes my heart, heart, heart jump with joy to see this uh, because we didn't have this when I was a kid. 
Uh, on behalf of the school board, I would like to just say, you know, uh, just congratulate the city and, and, and uh, you know, and thank them for, for coming together with us to make this happen. Uh, we do have some more parks coming around on some other schools uh, in the near future. And uh, it's, like I said, it's, it's kids, take advantage of this. It gives you a real good chance to come out here and play and, and, and have a good time and, and learn how to even, yeah, you know, I think we're gonna have fields where they can play team sports and so forth. And uh, again, you know, I wanna thank you all for having us here today and enjoy the day. And I, I, I see your eyes, kids, I think you're ready to go play. <laughs> all right, I look at that say yes. <laughs> all right, well, have a great great afternoon, you all. And, and again, thank you, Mayor, for, for having us here. And, and uh, I know this partnership's gonna go a long, long way to help us with the health of our, of our community. So thank you. You know, it's, it's, it's no secret that PSJA is one of the leaders in education and our mission and vision continues to be that we wanna offer a tapestry of opportunities to provide a first class education to all our students. These, these young students, our future, and we want to make sure that they continue to uh, do the do the right things in terms of building their education, in terms of building their quality of learning. And when you know the the research is pretty clear and consistent, while we're trying to develop their minds and make sure that their concentration is well, as we are getting them ready, uh, connected to college, it starts here. It starts early in elementary schools. But that concentration, uh, we also have research that says, and we have curriculum that supports this, that if students are having fun, if they're out there in physical activity, while we're trying to get their mind right, we also have to get their body uh, working as well. And when they do that, when they have that physical work that they have, and I know I can't wait till, till it gets a little warmer here and far, you'll be able to come out here and enjoy the water park as well. And then you're able to go back to doing reading, math, science, and be able to be that much more successful. So it, it is an honor and privilege to be able to partner with the city of FAR, to be able to serve this community, to be able to ensure that we continue to provide that quality life, that quality education that we want for each and every one of you all. So thank you all very much for coming out here. Thank you for this partnership, Mayor, and uh, thank our board for having that vision to be able to partner in something that's successful, that's going to continue to build on the great things that we're doing here in uh, Far San Juan Alamo. Thank you very much. So with that, we're gonna go ahead and move along to the ribbon cutting ceremony. Three.